Hello guys, and welcome back to Valkyria Chronicles. This is E.T. Young for this. Last time, one of our very valuable team members bit the bullet. Literally. And she's no longer with us. Rest in peace, Asara. Anyway, so now what will, what will Squad 7 do without a tank operator? I don't know. We'll uh, figure out, hopefully, in the kindred spirit. Hopefully. Let's begin the strategy meeting. First off, I need to ask. Lieutenant, how is Squad 7's morale? It's been three weeks since we lost Isara. We're all still in shock, Captain. Personally, it still doesn't seem real to me. I can't believe she's really gone. I see. Nevertheless, you have new orders. I sent in a request to General Damon to allow this op, and received full clearance. The Galleon Militia's next task is to liberate a small border town called Brule. The regiment will surround the area while your squad enters and secures the plaza. Any questions, Lieutenant? No, Captain. I'm taking temporary personal leave, but I wish you the best of luck out there. Also, I'd like to introduce the new tank pilot assigned to the Edelweiss. I'll do the best I can, Welkin. Kreese! He recently volunteered to be a pilot. I'm hereby assigning him to Squad 7. Isara inherited the Edelweiss from her father. I'd like to take over where she left off. I'm still nowhere near as skilled as she was, but I'll do my very best. Thank you, Chris. That concludes our meeting. I look forward to good news from Brule. Dismissed. Dismissed indeed. Yay! Chris from uh, R&D department. Hey! Chris and Leon and Isara all hung out together. Yeah, might as well bring back some of the spirit needed in order to get Squad 7 back up off the ground. Jaeger's reason. For those of you who don't know Jaeger is, go watch, I think it's chapter 5? Could be wrong. Thousand was lost, and Gregor with it, in a warrior's death. What comes next, Maximilian? Things aren't looking very good these days. The Empire claimed the earliest victories, and most of Galia with them. Their struggles since have vested the detachments holding each location. Meaning, we reconcentrate our forces? Yes. Send word to gather our armies on the Nagyar Plain. Silvaria, the time has come to show these rubes your power. Uh, I hate to break this to you, Maximilian, but she already has showed us her power, and... Quite frankly, it's scary. Sir, by my Valkyrian blood, I swear the Gallian forces will bow before you. <laughs> I believe it. They won't last long once you get serious. True, true. Silvaria is uh, the Empire's ace up their sleeve, so to speak. And that's good news for me and the prospects for Firald's reinstatement. Once we conquer Gallia, you shall have independence for your homeland, Jaeger. But until then, you have no country of your own. You shall serve us with your very life. I'm well aware, Your Grace. The fate of the Empire is no concern of mine. But Maximilian, you will be victorious. That's the only reason I'm fighting this war. Reclaim one's homeland. I. That is kind of an honorable reason to fight a war, depending on whose side you're going on. However, in this case, since you're going to be fighting for the Empire to enslave other people... I don't know. 
I will say this. Jaeger earns my respect towards the end of this game. He does. He And he will. Kind of odd to have a villain... Ha to have respect for a villain. Anyway, return to Brawl. More about that later on, but as of right now, we're gonna go focus on the mission at hand, I guess. We're back. Back to where it all started. It's been five months since we left Brule. Now, all but one of us is back to make this home again. Captain Varat said she specifically requested this operation from General Damon. She said that? Yes. You know how she feels about him, but she begged him to give us Brule. She wanted us to remember why we're fighting. To help us get past Isara's death. For right now, let's stop thinking and just move forward. Let's take back our... Take back Isara's home. It's always nice to be reminded what we're fighting for. If we don't have those moments in time to, where to st take a step back and be like, Why the hell are we doing this? You get lost very, very easily. So I'm Captain Verrat. Here's to you. You are awesome. Thank you for fighting for Squad Seven. Anyway, return to the temple. Onward and upward. Actually, isn't the temple back in Barius Desert? Why are we back here again? I thought we were in Brol. Back again. I had to return one more time. Faldio, what are you up to? But the area we saw last time, no matter what I try, the door won't open anymore. What was written on those walls turns all of Europa's history on its head. It's staggering. It began, Welcome, Sister Valkyria. Did they hide the truth from all but their own? The door won't let me in. Given what's on the walls, maybe it opens only for the Valkyrie. Maximilian got through, but he had Salvaria with him. She must have opened it for him. But wait. The door was closed when we first arrived. So, does that mean we have an ace up our sleeve? No, it's not. The chances of her. No, there's no other explanation. She. What should I do? Folio. I don't like how this is going, in what direction the story is headed. If you guys remembered all the way back when we learned how Valkyr Valkyrs unleash their true potential, keep that in mind. Anyway, recapture of Brawl! Let's go take Brawl back! You will now be briefed on the operation. The enemy is entrenched in a defensive formation throughout the central Brawl and the Windmill Plaza. Squad 7 will enter from this location and cut a path into the town center. Your objective is, to, is the occupation of the enemy's base camp. Expect the fighting along the main street to be exceptionally fierce. We also have information suggesting that they've placed snipers at various key points across town. Even if you don't see anyone in the immediate area, you may still be open to sniper fire. Be careful where you stop. Yeah. Trust me when they say there are snipers on this map. There are snipers on this map. Alright, let's go ahead and get them up here. And I'll go ahead and 
brief you on the situation at hand once I get my units in place. Largo! Alright. I like you, Claudia. Don't ask me why. Bring a sniper along. I have actually trained my snipers up a few levels, so... Yeah. That could be... Just my edge. You know what? Let's bring another sniper along. Bring both snipers. We'll see if this will actually work out the way I want it to plan it. All right, we're set to begin. Good, Good luck, luck Captain Drott. Thank you for this mission. Isara, we're taking back our home, Is. Squad 7, move out! Alright, this map... Me. Yeah. Phew, here we are. Sorry, but I'm a little... Ah, uh, don't worry, Kreese, you'll get used to it. That's right. This is your first time out in battle, isn't it? Well, yeah, he has his ass sitting back in R&R &R all the time. Combat is always a scary thing. I don't think anyone should ever forget that. I feel like getting used to the horror of war means losing hope. Yes, sir. I understand. Okay, then. Let's begin. Everybody, watch out for enemy snipers. Okay, th in order to get an A rank on this map, you have to one turn it. It's possible to do. It is extremely possible to one turn this map. We need to get all the way up, up there. The only way that you're going to one turn this map is actually use a scout in order to do it. However, I'm not going to be one turning this map. <laughs> I'm going to be two turning it. Why? Uh, you'll see why in a little bit. Anyway, Marina, where are you? I need you and your sniping abilities. I shall snipe snipers and all sorts of fun jazz. Alright, howdy trooper. You shall die. Oh, I love snipers. Especially during this part of the game. This part of the game this is where snipers really, really shine. From here on out. And I think I shall sh have you shoot one more time. Why? Hey, sniper! I sees you up there. Sniping at snipers. Oh, hey! You freaking... Yeah, I'll go ahead and end it right there. Come on, Marina, one more time. I want to get rid of that sniper. Why? I have no idea why. Zoom in. Yay! Get you knocked off of there. Sweet dreams. Alright, Marina. I think you're good right there. Nobody's going to be sniping you. At least as far as I know. Hmm. Alright, Edelweiss. I need you. Why? Because there's a tank up here, and uh, once I actually show it to you, this tank up here is an ace. Yeah, enemy ace. Right there. Goodbye. Oh, hey, you actually freaking dodged the blast. <laughs> How the crap is the. Is that guy still standing? All right. Let's see. Yeah, this tank right here, I want to destroy that tank. There is a very, very nice little attachment on him that I want to put on the Edelweiss. A uh, nice little actual upgrade to the Edelweiss, which will make things a little... Well... A little bit easier. 
but I won't kill it until I actually get a good clear shot at its behind because I want to take this guy out in as little shots as I possibly can all right one more time then I should be able to get into firing range yo dude I can see your back yes I can oh hey you really really all right we'll go ahead and do this the hard way then go ahead and do this the hard way goodbye death to you all right Edelweiss there you go there's a good boy and now hey sniper I seize you uh, Marina you don't have any more ammo let's try Oscar let's see if Oscar can get, can get a good clear shot at this sniper yeah there's this what how is there a freaking trooper all the way up there oh that's a sniper okay oh yeah go Oscar oh I love freaking snipers all right now let's hope I don't get sniped because this could be freaking bad if they want to snipe me. All right, enemies, let's go ahead and do this. Freaking dance, man. Dance. Oh, hey! You can actually go and freaking snipe in the Aedelweiss. How's that for fun? What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes they really don't make any sense whatsoever. You missed. Miss. And they must have really good eyesight if they can actually do that. Yeah, hiding behind a lamp post. Of course, that's gonna. Really? What? Okay, that's just confusing. You just moved him back into position. Okay, don't ask. You really want to take care of Alicia, don't you, buddies? Well, you know what I have to say to that. You know what I have to say to that, guys. You know exactly what I'm going to have to say to that. Come on, Alicia, let's go ahead and blitz this place. Moving out. Let's go ahead and uh, say hello for them trying to snipe you. Out of my way, peeps. Hey, Scout, I seize you, but do you see me? No, you do not. All right. Good job, Alicia. Enemy unit spotted. All right, cool. Now, my turn, okay? Go run fast. Avoid the mines. Watch out for the mines. I said watch out for the mines, Alicia. Oh well, whatever. Ow. Oh, that's really gonna hurt. That is really, really gonna hurt. Hmm. Fine, Alicia's not gonna make it. Defense boost. Plan B. 
Come on, Aka. I should be able to take this map with, like, four CP, so I'm not worried about it at all. I'm not worried about it. About, uh, that one little setback. But... Ah, oh, screw you and your poison allergy, Aka. You can work through it. You can work through it. Really? Two times in a row? Why are you not... Eh. Confusing is all get at. Whatever. I don't care. Yo, buddy. I seize you. Right, here I go. Alright, let's try the left side then. Alright, you know what? You need to stand up. It's over. And die. And yeah, he is an elite, of course. Hmm. No problem, boss. No problem indeed. We're just getting Woo! I don't know what that does, but that might just be my edge in actually defeating this. Haha! <laughs> Alright. I got this in the bag now. I got this in the bag. No problem, boss. Don't care about that freaking sniper, or not sniper, the... What you call him? Shock trooper. All right. No. And thank you. Thank you. Let's try attack boost. That might help be helpful. That might be very helpful. But yeah, this map is extremely short. This chapter is extremely short. We go from a long chapter to an extremely short chapter. We're just getting warmed up. I think... Really? The attack boost did nothing to you. Alright. Alright, whatever. Just have to use an extra CP in order to actually take this camp. That's all that is. Goodbye, and now Brule is now ours. Perfect. East, this one's for you. Operation complete, baby. Ah, oh, yeah. Yay! Sir, we've done it. We've occupied the enemy's primary base. Great. That's excellent. Grease, I'm proud of you. Sir, I still can't hold a candle to Isara, but I did what I could. It's ours, Ys. Home is finally home again. And your Edelweiss is alive and well and in good hands. You can rest easy. Thank you, Kreese, for leading us into... Uh, what you call it? Victory! Victory shall be ours! That is a lot of experience and money. Ah, we get sniper rifle, and we also get the block pin from the enemy. I think that improves accuracy. I could be wrong, but I want it nonetheless. Why? Because I can. Yeah. Hope amid the wreckage. Go lion's paw. Well, that's it, Welkin. No sign of the enemy here, either. I searched all over. Looks like they've cleared out of Brule. That's good. We've finally recovered possession of our old homestead. Yeah. But if Isara saw it as it is now, I think she'd feel sad. I mean, look at it. 
Empty of all the people who lived here, the mill just barely standing? Huh? Look at that! Welkin? What is it? What do you see? Look! A lion's paw! Uh, is it... the same one? Mm-hmm. It's the flower that you planted that day. When we'd first met each other. It took root and grew in this soil. And now it's flourishing. Mm-hmm. Remember what you said? That there's more going on in this world than just people killing people? There are new lives all around. New things being born, even in the middle of war. I was right. And if I let myself get depressed, well, Isara wouldn't want that. Once this war's over and we come home, we'll just have to rebuild it. We'll rebuild all of it. Every last building. Yes, we will. And we'll show Martha's little boy. We'll show him the town where he was born. Yeah. That's right. That's what we're fighting for. We're fighting for not just Isara, but for Martha and the baby and for every single person in Brule. It's one of those things that, like I said before, guys, you have to remember what you're fighting for. If you don't, you're going to get lost in the crowd. You're going to get trodden down, beat down, smashed to how many pieces? I mean, granted, if you know what you're fighting for, you might be broken down into little bitty pieces anyway, but you have the will to hold on. Anyway, enough about that. The approaching clash. The liberation of Brule was a success. Excellent work, soldiers. Lieutenant Gunther, do you have anything further to report? Yes, Captain. Through this op, I... We've found a new goal to strive towards. Very good. And Faldio, you're back from your leave. Feeling rested and ready? Uh, yes, Captain. I'm ready. Good. We're receiving reports of major shifts along the front lines. Imperial forces previously posted all over the country are gathering at one point. The Nagyar Plain in northeastern Gallia. Our forces are being directed there as well. Does that mean we're expecting a major clash at Nagyar, Captain? It's very probable. This battle is going to decide Gallia's fate one way or another. After a brief rest, the militia move out to Nagyar. I want all of you rested in the meantime. You're dismissed. Yeah, I'm just gonna say this about Nagyar, guys. This is where the game turns. For the worst. Everything up until this point, the upcoming, the next chapter, chapter 13, has just been child's play. I know I've said that before, or something to that point, but you ain't seen nothing yet. But the war is not over, it's just beginning. Once the war is over, what will Welkin do? Yeah, we'll find out. So what you're saying is, the next battle is so critical, it could actually determine how the rest of the war goes. Yeah. Both for us and them. The opposing armies are assembling their forces at Nagyar. It'll be the biggest battle we've fought yet. The biggest battle of the war. That means more things we love will be destroyed. More people we care about will be taken away. There are some things we lose that never get returned. That's the world. Everything around us is in flux. The old Brule, the town we used to know, 
Isara. We've lost them forever. Welkin. But it's like you said, Alicia. We build new things as we lose the old. If we can win this battle at Nagyar, we can push the Empire all the way back to Northeast Gallia. If that happens, then victory will be right around the corner. <sighs> Once the war's over, the real work will start. We'll build a new mill plaza. In fact, we'll build a whole new town. Right. And I'll be there to help you. You know, it's funny. Whenever I talk to you, I feel like everything's going to be fine. Yeah? Well, you're the only reason I haven't completely lost it, Alicia. Really? Thank you, Welkin. Me too. I'm glad we were able to meet and work together. Hey, Welkin? What is it? Once this war is all over, I have... There's something I want to tell you. Anything? 